So I finally got this thing to work in my car. It's a CD player, portable CD player, old one at that, playing crystal clear sound through the FM station. Um, it's not Bluetooth because the cars, the new cars, I'm in the 2022 Nissan Rogue, and most of these cars have Bluetooth, but they're only pinging one way. They're not allowing you to plug any kind of third party uh, Bluetooth unless it's a phone. It has to be an iPhone or Android. You must use some kind of paid app like a, a Spotify or, or something like that, or you have to use a Cyrus now, um, or satellite radio. They want you to do the satellite radio because they're getting a kickback. Car companies are, are getting paid when you guys sign up for those one-year to five-year subscriptions through satellite. So they took out the auxiliary cord for that purpose. They took out the CD player for that purpose. Not because they don't like CD players, not because they don't like aux cords, uh, or they don't have any room for them. They have plenty of room for them, you know, and they don't, leave a, they don't even leave a nice space in this car for you to put a different radio. It's, it's, it's made for just this radio. I can't put a radio under here because they want to trap me into buying Cyrus Radio, which is already on their radio. See that? It's already on their radio. They want you to have that. Now, Bluetooth is not universal. Like I said, you, you can only ping out. That means um, I would have to turn on Bluetooth here and on my phone, I'll see Rogue, Nissan Rogue. But if I have a device like this device here and it's Bluetooth, there's no screen that says Rogue on here so I can't connect it because it doesn't see this as a Bluetooth device in here. I can't connect nothing in there um, saying Bluetooth. So it's only a one-way transmitting, not a receiving in on these cars so they deliberately do that so you have to work around it and i worked around it with this little unit right here i'm going to leave a description on the bottom and all i did um with this was go to the fm station i went to a low channel like 88.1 and i saved it right here and i but i put my transmitter on the same channel is on the same channel 88.1 and it's playing um through this thing flawlessly now there are some trans transmitters out there that don't sound good i tried one uh, from uh, Walmart is called on and it sounds like crap 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 But this one I got here. I can't pronounce it. It started with a SC is I think it's a French company But um, I'm gonna put the link below where you can click on it and see exactly which one I'm talking about and um, It sounds crystal clear and all you have to do is put it match the channel frequencies and, that, and that's it and you keep it uh, Keep it turned on. Um, it does take batteries. It takes a uh, AAA battery just two of them And I'm sure it's gonna last a long time because it's only a small a small thing you know, so it's not gonna, gonna not gonna burn out on you. But um, that's it, man. Get yourself uh, one of these units and get your CDs back playing, and don't be um, pigeonholed into into or tricked into um, getting Cyrus Radio or any other kind of subscription if you don't really want that. You know, what I mean, you may just want to play your CDs. You may just want to play your old iPod. You know, and plug in the auxiliary cable into it, and you know, them taking out the auxiliary cable here and taking out the CD player is really, really ridiculous. All right, this your man Bobby Washington. Please subscribe to the channel.